The last 12 hours of my life have, or 12 to, mm, let's say 15 to be safe, has been quite interesting. And it's all due to one thing, one device. My phone. Yes. My phone. See if you can see that. I just packaged it up. Let's say about <clears throat> 14 hours ago, I was on my phone, on YouTube, and it just bling, 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 bling. I thought maybe the battery was dead, right? Then it came back on. Then it went back off. Came back on. Went back off. And when it comes on, it, do it doesn't get past the uh, the one touch Alcatel screen. And then there's two more screens after that, which is uh, the T-Mobile and yada, yada, yada. But the phone went to hell. I don't know what the deal is with the phone. I charged it, thinking maybe, you know, it's dead, wasn't dead, uh, charged it a bit, went to like the behind the scenes screens, whatever, by, by holding the up volume button and power at the same time, I cleared cache, I rebooted, last resort was to go back to factory settings, did that, nothing worked. So luckily and thankfully, I had a, um, an extended warranty with it so I called the 1-800 number and told them what was going on and um, they emailed me a shipping label and told me that I need to ship the phone back to them and the moment UPS scans in the shipping is when they'll email me a voucher or a coupon uh, or in-store credit for the value of this phone right here so that way I can go get another phone. But that's just one incident of my problems that was caused by this. Um, woke up late this morning due to me not having an alarm. Uh, was almost late getting the young boy to school because I was late. And also had a dream in which I don't remember. And um, I woke up in a real shitty mode. You know when they say you dream about you dream every night, but a lot of a lot of the dreams you don't remember. Well, it's it's one of them type of incidents. But whatever type of dream it was, I'm pretty sure it was a nightmare because I woke up in a real funky mood. You know, so so um and another one is uh I'm still on standby with this whole court mess. So I have no idea if the state's attorney is trying to contact me right now or not. I have no other phone to call and check my voice messages either. So, I got to go ahead and get this phone in here as fast as possible, have these folks to scan it, and go home, get on my computer, and make sure and check my email. Just keep checking my email, waiting for that voucher so I can run to the store and get me a new phone. Good morning. How are you? I'm well. How about you? Good. What can I do for you? Uh, scan this thing in. I hear it is. Trying to ship it out. You too. Thank you. So, got that scan, so. Let's get to my doggone computer and um, see if I can get um, this voucher. And you know what sucks about this too? Like typically when you do things like this and you get an email, you can check your phone, right? 
and the voucher is in your email you can pull it up whatever and you go to the store and they scan it but in this case it's all about the phone and I don't have no phone so it's definitely got to be printed out what's going on World Wide Web it's another day it is Thursday November 3rd 2016 and I am still without a phone so in about mm, 15 minutes or so it'd be 24 hours since I I sent out the phone to um, the extended warranty company yeah I haven't heard from them I'm waiting on an email from them basically in the email they're gonna send like a uh, coupon slash voucher slash gift card so I can go up into the store and um, get a phone or anything I want um, equal the value or less so um, yeah I'm just waiting on that email and the crazy thing about it is I can't check my email from my phone duh got to go to um, the computer in a place that has internet to do so so I feel feel kind of strange you know I know there's gonna be certain people that's thinking that I'm ignoring them or brushing them off because um, a lot of people don't pay attention to my social media uh, my Facebook profile my Facebook page um, my Twitter my Instagram my tumblr and YouTube I believe I've announced on all of those platforms that I don't have a phone but people ain't got time and, or just not on their mind <clears throat> that way um, and speaking of uh, the balance of Libra social media video um, I've asked a few people if they tuned in to the um, balance of Libra and they'd be like I'm not on Facebook like that and I'm like what do you mean like this is not on Facebook I may post a link of the video onto Facebook but the balance of Libra is not debuted or it's not uh, played on Facebook you know like that's some type of excuse um, just simply subscribe to my YouTube channel and you don't have to be on YouTube and you don't have to be on Facebook it comes to your phone or it comes to your email so you don't have to leave your place of comfort on your phone in order to watch my videos you know if you subscribe and then after you subscribe you tap the bell you can eventually get notifications right on your notification bar at the top of your phone it'll notify you let you know that uh, Jacob Israel aka Trey Libra has uploaded another video so uh, on with that I'm dropping the young boy off to school You don't want to leave me. But I, love you. I love you too, baby. So I just dropped him off. Um, kind of tough. He wanted like five hugs and love, love, love. He didn't want to let me go. Um, my two youngest boys, Uriah and Azriel, they get into these uh, moments where um, <clears throat> they just want to give me love. They don't want to uh, be uh, detached from me like it's just like I don't know what brings that on it's just like daddy 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 I love you love you love you and it's um, my two older boys and my daughter um, I don't see signs of uh, that from them um, but uh, yeah the two youngest are very like clean very attached at times so, but anyways, I'm uh, gonna take my laptop to perhaps uh, Chick-fil-A, Walmart, somewhere with internet, and I can uh, continue to check my email and uh, see what's going on. I'm talking. Mm -mm. That's something I don't believe. Yeah, uh -uh. I'm calling you from Google. Oh, 
You calling me from the computer? Yeah, my um Google account. Uh-uh. Is it gonna call call you? No, it's free. <laughs> Look, I'ma show you. If I can zoom in with the, the uh, I got you on the balance of Libra. I'm gonna edit this later. See right here? Okay. It's got uh -huh. <laughs> zero dollars. Hold on. Let me click the thing so they can sh see. Right here. Stop. See? Okay. Huh? See, it says Vivian Ann Lewis' mom. Y'all don't okay. be calling my mom. I gotta bur I gotta blur this number out because people on the balance of Libra probably gonna be calling you. I gotta figure out a way. To, um, I gotta figure out a blur this out. Never be calling me. He's a left. I'm telling a lot, not my son. All right. And let him go. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Still no word on my phone. Um. And I refuse to be a slave to my computer all day. Um, it's, it's been driving me nuts because I feel like for the past two days I've been on my computer and in my email just like waiting on the email to get my own my voucher to go get a new phone I'm gonna close this vlog out right now um, it's about two three days of vlogging so um, and today is the day I need to release it so I need to go ahead and put the SD card in the computer and start editing it um, if you aren't subscribed already to this channel, which is Jacob Israel, but of course my name has changed. I'm Trey Libra now. Um, if you haven't subscribed, please do so. Uh, give this video a thumbs up. Um, comment at the bottom. The bottom. Um, and share it. Please share it. Helps me out a lot. And, um... Okay, put the money in the bag. All right, all right. Stop stalling, put the money in the bag. Okay, okay. Like Mike did radio Way back then in the 80s, yo Protect your soul, don't sell it for gold Just a little advice that an old man told You can tell the truth, still reach your goals When they wave that money, yeah, please don't fold Most of these rappers off Even summit to come to court to testify Whatever, I don't know what I'm even gonna testify about Like, I didn't see the dude, I don't even know what he looked like Only thing that happened to me was My car was a victim so I guess they want my testimony of that. Um, I hope somehow that I'm going to get paid in one way or another. I know the state's getting paid by it.